Hey guys, today's episode is sponsored by JJ Games, a wide variety used game store. Make sure to check them out at jjgames.com, and I've been using them for multiple years. Make sure to check them out, and that is jjgames.com. Alright guys, let's get into the episode. Bye-bye. Hey guys, welcome back to Metal Gear Solid 2, uh, Sons of Liberty. Make sure to like and subscribe, and here we go. Just little claps for me. Excellent speech, my friend. Who the... Gift of the silver tongue. They say it's the mark of a good officer. And of a liar. Americans are too in love with the sound of their own voice to speak the truth. Identify yourself. I am Shalashaska. Also called Revolver Ocelot. What do you want? This machine will be quite useful. What are you planning to do? Steal this thing? Steal? No, no. I'm taking it back. I've a chance to escape. Three of them had had the gun to his back. Nobody move. Understood. Real vision. This ship now carries enough Simtex on its key structural points to blow it out of the water at the touch of this button. That's right. No one has to die needlessly. Like, hey, didn't Randy meet up with you down the corridors? What happened to Randy? the nuclear research outpost. What are you talking about? After the Cold War ended, my home was bought out by the Americans. Is there a point to this sad story? Not you would understand. Land, friends, dignity, all sold to the highest bidder, the United States of America. Even the technology that gave birth to these weapons is Russian, developed by us. What do you intend to do? Russia will rise again. And Ray is the key. I regret to inform you that I have no intention of selling Metal Gear. As I said, I came to take it back. Oh. Yes, returned to the Patriots. The Lale Lule Lo. What? How's that possible? Ocelot, you, have you sold us out? <laughs> I was never in your employ, Golukovic. Are you still in league with Solidus? No hard feelings, Colonel. Mother Russia can rot for all I care. Since when, Ocelot? When did you turn? I'm glad you noticed, comrade. I abandoned her during the Cold War. Ah! 
Metal Gear only has room for one! Gerukovich, you and your daughter will die here. Damn you! <laughs> Very loud. <laughs> Honestly, it doesn't matter because it's um, I, boot, I boost up the audio. Look at all that burst motion blare. Uh, uh. <laughs> Sergey, looks like you were long overdue for retirement. I trust. So this is before we shot his trigger off? <laughs> Wait, what? Show's over. If you wish to live, I suggest you run now. This ship is still in the lower New York Harbor. You may yet make it to shore if you swim for your life. Rumbling, rumbling, tumbling. in time. I know what it's like, brother. No wonder Naomi passed you over for the Fox Dive program. Ouch! Get out of my, my mind, mind, liquid! So he took the liquid's arm? Yeah. Uh, you know, like the the, 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 the thought physical behind. Technology. Few more years and you'll be another of like a, of like a uh, our raw materials are vintage, brother. Yeah, the boss was in his late fifties when they created his feel, feel, yeah, feel yeah, so, things. Yeah. They're going off an extreme that just the arm yeah, yeah. takes him apart in the parade. It was pretty strong, I'm pretty sure. He was an insane twin. Yeah, because yeah, like, did he shoot his head hand off in the first game? So... No, we got sliced off by a uh, gray box. Don't 
have what it takes after all! You're going down, Snake, with this tanker! Four. Man, the Melvins are so cool looking. Fun love for super robots that are like super weak. <laughs> they screw it. Like a robot tier direct the raid, but then your raids aren't that like strong like mecha wise, like you know, super robot war wise. Well, like, I, think they can... I don't know. I think get it in like, water. Like, get it in yeah. water, it might be all strong. Yeah, like, the, like I think yeah, maybe Voltron, I'm not sure, yeah. But like I know well, Vol it has to be Voltron without the special characters. It has to be like a skeleton crew. Uh, <laughs> Like I think it could be a like a normal like first generation Gundam, like the like the like the mod jobbers, but not like the like obviously like Gundam Wing yeah. version four or whatever. Because like yeah, it does have a nuke on it, so I uh, know I think the morph suit ones. Yeah, uh, probably yeah. It might it compete. Yeah, but it couldn't kill. It could kill like it could kill like a like. Well, we all. well first of all, first one to go down space and just fucking drop a bomb on it would win. Yeah. Because nukes can't go in that stratosphere. It's easy. Satellite cannon, yeah, I could run destroy it. Look at this thing, look at this thing you can do. It's pretty deal. No. Took that water. Oh shit, it's gonna convert it. Oh shit. Now it's a laser beam. Water beam. Uh, That's what oh. hydro beam supposed to be. Hydro pump. Hydro pump. Oh, hydro pump. Uh, hydro pump. Is that so, a water beam or whatever? No, hydro pump. Ice beam, 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 ice the, the people of Elga don't show up. Uh, really? Yeah. Well, all goes there, but like the reinforcements don't come. So if there's no reinforcements, there's I don't hear there's anyone in the hallways. Discussed. Yes, I have photographic evidence of Snake on the scene. The cipher was most useful. I look forward to tomorrow morning's news flash. I would say the Marine Corps' plans are on indefinite hold. Yes, of course, Mr. President. Uh, President Black, or is he still white? Yeah. Uh, this was 2009, so that. Snake! It's push time. Was push 02 to 09? I don't remember. I think so, because Obama was from whatever to whatever. <laughs> whatever to whatever? <laughs> Eight years. 2012 to <laughs> 2018. Eight years, yeah. Eight, 18 so... Is it four year term? Yeah, it's four years term, but then you get up to uh, two yeah. terms, so eight years. Yeah, so it'd be 2000, 2010, 2018. Mm -hmm. So 
I've seen a thousand pickers for your top bottom. Now we're into the real game! Snake, do you remember the sinking of that tanker two years ago? Of course. Terrorists blow a hole in an oil tanker full of crude barely 20 miles off the shore of Manhattan. Your classic nightmare. It didn't take long for the government to put an oil fence around the whole mess. And then that massive offshore cleanup facility went up inside. The big shell. I hear the cleanup isn't quite over yet. It takes time. But in the meantime, the shell's become a landmark. A symbol of environmental protection. Deploy at the big shell as scheduled. Approximately six hours ago, the big shell was seized by an armed group. Do we have an ID? Former members of the Navy SEAL Special Anti-Terrorist Training Squad Dead Cell. Russian private army members may also be involved. It's a highly trained group, and they have the big shell under complete control. Big cell control, uh, controlled by the big cell. Ah, there he is. So, when I originally played this game, I did realize that this game, uh, this, that this big shell thing was like out in the middle of nowhere, not in the harbor of New York. from one of the major conservation groups, and one from our own government. The most important person in a sense. The most important person? James Johnson. The president? Unless the demands are met, the terrorists intend to blow the big shell out of the water. And the crude will ignite, turning the Manhattan Harbor into an inferno. That's not the worst case scenario. If the chlorides being used to decontaminate the seawater go up with the oil, toxins containing catastrophic levels of dioxins will be released. In other words, the bay's ecosystem will be wiped out, and the sea will turn into toxins like it's for centuries, becoming the worst environmental disaster in history. I had no sneak was an environmentalist or a. You have two mission objectives. One, infiltrate the offshore decontamination facility Big Shell and safeguard the president and other hostages. And two, disarm the terrorists by any means necessary. Does deadly force count as? <laughs> you should know that SEAL Team 10 is also conducting a rescue operation. Is this a joint effort? No. Foxhound remains a covert body. Don't alert them to your presence. That is an order. This is Snake. I'm now inside strut A of shell one. How are things? Right. We're in luck. Looks like there are no sentries posted here. What's the visibility? Yeah. The lights on the That's not Snake. <laughs> I won't have to use the IR goggles. Any problems? Yeah, there was a brand new hole cut through the oil fence. There's someone else besides me that wanted to get in badly. That's not possible. What about SEAL Team 10? They landed on the roof of the yeah, big shell as planned. Guys, like the and by the way, the first Snake, we're changing your code name for all following communication. What's wrong with Snake? Just a precaution. You are now designated Raiden. All right, Raiden. You've already covered infiltration in VR training. I've completed 300 missions in VR. I feel like some kind of legendary mercenary. Okay, we'll skip that part. Make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. When you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to reach you, contact you the codec will beep when you hear that noise press the select button the codex Sad. receiver directly stimulates the small bones of your ear <laughs> no I just realized you that. Um, I have a uh, hand grip here and it spells changes. Kutek first make your way to the upper section of the big shell 
How do I get up to the next level? There's a fucking There's elevator, you dumbass. That area. Use that. Sounds good. By the way, you realize that they're the mimicking Metal Gear One with this? Yeah. fiber technology, a byproduct of fiber optics oh, research. The texture isn't far removed from rubber, but the material protects against a wide range of toxic substances. The suit itself has a wide array of built-in sensors. It is referred to as smart skin in military R&D. Data about damage to different regions of the body, including blood loss, is exchanged between the suit and the intravenous nanomachines to create a feedback system. There's a lot of pressure on my torso. Relax. The suit applies varying pressure to major internal organs to maximize performance and safeguard their functions. They call this the skull suit Foxhound. Skull suit seems appropriate somehow. The hatch with a circular handle will open into the elevator area. Locate the hatch first. Copy that. Moving on to main mission objectives. All right, guys, this will be in the episode. Make sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time. My name's Evil Beast. Thank you for watching this episode. Make sure to like and subscribe. And, guys, I've actually opened up a Patreon channel. Make sure to click the affiliate link down below. Or not the affiliate link, they're the link down below, I think. Anyways, <laughs> thank you guys for supporting me. Thank you for watching this episode. And, guys, just thank you so much. All right, bye.